you for joining us today. We have lots of messages on our Facebook. Today, we're in for our last segment. Today. It's very exciting. Marina Gillis, from, uh, the CEO from Aqualus, she's telling us all about the benefits of clean cannabis. So tell us about your connection to Veterans for Healing and uh, maybe streamline it a little bit. And then tell us some of the benefits, Myrna. So uh, the connection, I think what I'd start with is that if you look at the uh, the program uh, that, that the, the federal government uh, covers in relation to veterans. Atlanta, Canada, and I'll start, I'll start that way and narrow it down to, to Nova Scotia where we are. But Atlanta, Canada makes up about 40% of the folks that are in veterans that are in that program. And you know, that is very significant relative to our population. And what that tells you about our community is, is that obviously there's a number of uh, veterans uh, from Atlanta, Canada that served. You know that it, and, and served in disproportionately high numbers uh, to to many other parts of the country. You know potentially. So um, I think that you know and and that kind of rings true. You know to this idea of a commitment to service. Okay. Uh, and 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 that's very much you know I think how that collaborative approach that we do take here in Nova Scotia um, and and Atlanta Canada uh, and the Maritimes. And so you have a little bit of that sort of spirit of, of working together and trying to take care of each other because everybody in the Maritimes or in Canada is a neighbor, right? That, okay. That's a sort of a founding sort of belief that we have. So with that, um, you know, we, 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 we knew uh, Fabian and Jim and, and the group from, from Veterans for Healing. And I've known, I've known Fabian for years. I, I, I met Fabian would have been back in 2014. And um, when, when all of this was coming about and he was a very good advocate. And I was also an advocate in, in, um, the social justice space because my background was originally as a lawyer before I got into cannabis. And so oh, okay. our, 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 yeah, I, I worked in the vulnerable services sector, persons with uh, disabilities, employment, um, vulnerable services, intellectual disabilities, mental health, physical disabilities, homelessness as well. Wow. So that was my background for, for most of my career. And so, you know, over the years you would see, um, you know, people in the community um, uh, and, and you formed relationships and, and you, you trusted each other and you respected each other for the good work that you were doing. And, um, and, and that's really how we came together, you know, and, and we, we, we thought, you know what, this is, we're doing good work, you're doing good work. And I think we, together, we would, would be even better uh, because, and what I love about their model um, is, you know, we, we basically, you know, we're, 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 we give a suite of incredible products and, and a commitment to service, but what they give is, is, is all of all, everything, you know, that, that would help you um, live your best life. You know, I think that, that, that it's, it's not just about um, one part of a person, you know, it's about the whole person. It's about your mental health. It's about your family. It's about integrating, you know, into your community and not feeling like you're alone. You know, because often what happens when, you know, when you leave services is that you, you had this camaraderie and community that embraced you and, 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 and celebrated you. And, and then, you know, then sometimes you feel disconnected um, when, when that ends. And so what the beautiful thing about what they do is that, you know, that all of the best mm -hmm. of what that brings and all of the best of what camaraderie and support is, is it continues and it continues after you've completed your service. And I think that's, um, you know, we, we came together because we had a common vision. Um, we work well together because we share the same values and, um, and we want the same thing, you know, which is to have, you know, cannabis and other, um, you know, support for your health uh, to, to, to lead, you know, really wonderful, uh, effective, productive lives uh, and, and be celebrated and recognized um, uh, and, and also to be met where you are, you know, at any given time along your journey. Well, I, I really commend what you're doing and I can attest just because like you said, I have interviewed Fabian, I've interviewed Vince, I've interviewed Stefan and all three of them have just said the, the marijuana, the cannabis is nothing but help. Myrna's organization is wonderful. We're a great team together. So I really, I really thank you for doing this and helping our heroes, right? Because they are our heroes and they deserve 
they deserve the best treatment. If people want to find out, Myrna, more about your platform, can you give us your website? They, they can go there, check it out. Yes, it's Aqualitas, A-Q-U-A-L-I-T-A-S dot C-A. It's always a handful. Um, and there's some really neat, if you look around, um, we've got a, there's a, there's a, an Eastlink video uh, actually called How It's Made, which is a 22 minute show that, that shows our, you know, really front and back house, like how everything is done. Um, and there's some really cool videos on there and on, on YouTube as well about uh, the aquaponics and how it's done. So, um, but if but, you want to share that link with us after the show, I would more, more than happy put it on our Facebook page for and, and blast it out. Yeah, no, that I, I'd be, that'd be great. I'll, I'll, I'll send it to you uh, after we uh, after we finish chatting. And and look, I want to thank you too for the work that you're doing and the advocacy that you know that you you champion as well. Um, I, I you know I think that it, it's it's hard sometimes to amplify your voice when you're at a place where you're struggling. And so um, you know when you have people out there that that do that for you and that, you know, shine a light on things that really do need to be, um, you know, given, given their due and some, you know, some thoughtful, not just um, celebration, but also, you know, when, when you're not celebrating, you know, when things are tough, um, yeah. that's when it matters. You know, it's, it's, it, it, your character is not necessarily reflected when things are great. Your character is reflected when things aren't great. That's right. Um, you know, so I think that, you know, the, the, the kind of work that you're doing, the kind of work that obviously Veterans for Healing is doing, what we're trying to, you know, to, to be part of that and in, 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 in our in our way yeah. uh, is really, really important. Well, I think that's great. And, and I can only just uh, attest like, you know, wonderful job. So I really, again, I want to thank the CEO from Aqualitas, Myrna Gillis, for being on the show today. Hopefully this interview will help people because we're going to blast out the edited version, of course, if people do want to continue to comment on Facebook. I really appreciate that. What we're going to do now, we're going to let Myrna go. We're going to come back and we're going to wrap the show. So stay tuned. You're watching the Today Show Toronto. I'm Jay Stone. Thanks, Jay.